Step 1. Recording a Teams Meeting. This is the first and most important step, so please pay close attention. Get in the habit of starting the recording as soon as you enter the meeting. This will ensure you capture the entire class or meeting if someone joins in late or if there are any technical difficulties. If you are very forgetful, ask one of your students, coworkers, or friends to remind you before each class or meeting until it becomes an automatic habit. Now that we've got that important reminder out of the way, let's get started. First, open the Teams app and choose the Teams tab on the left-hand side. Click which team you want to meet in, and in the upper right corner, click Meet. If you don't want your background shown, perhaps you're in your messy room, you can apply background filters here. Try not to choose one that's too colorful or bright, as it will take away from the important information in the meeting. I typically choose one of the white office spaces. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to turn my camera off. Click Join Now. Once you begin the meeting, you will see a bar at the top that has a running time in the upper left corner. Then moving to the right, you have options for Show Participants, Show Conversation, a smiley face with options to Like, Heart, Applause, Laugh, Raise Your Hand, an option for Breakout Rooms, three little dots labeled More Actions, an option for camera, microphone, share content, and the leave option in the upper right corner. To begin recording, click the three little dots labeled more actions and a drop down menu of 13 to 14 options will appear. They are as follows. Device settings, meeting options, meeting notes, Meeting Details, Gallery, Large Gallery, Together Mode, Focus, Full Screen, Apply Background Effects, Turn on Live Captions, Start Recording, Dial Pad, and Turn Off Incoming Video. You may or may not see the option labeled Dial Pad. Don't worry either way, we won't be using that today. Click Start Recording, which is the second or third option from the bottom. When you press Record, it will take a few moments to start because it will alert other participants. In the upper left corner, right next to the running time, you will see a red recording dot, and a pop-up ribbon at the top will appear stating that you're recording and prompt you to let everyone know. You can click Dismiss. Once you're done with the meeting, click on the three little dots again and click Stop Recording, which is the second or third option from the bottom. A pop-up will appear asking if you want to stop recording. Click Stop Recording in the lower right corner. A pop-up ribbon will appear saying your recording is being saved. Leave the meeting and your recording will be saved in the meeting chat available for download for 20 days. Click download from the chat. Give it a few seconds to download and you will see the video saved to your downloads folder. Step one is complete. Now that we've recorded the Teams meeting, we're ready to upload the video to Stream. Check out the step two video, Uploading a Video to Stream, to learn how to upload your recorded meetings to Stream.